Good morning, Harris Chapel family. It is Saturday, the twenty, uh, the twenty sixth of December, and we have six days left in this wild and crazy year. Tomorrow, Laura Stoops will bring the message, and I'm excited about what God has laid on her heart. And later this evening, I'm going to upload a message because I just, I got some stuff I want to share with you. I got a sermon I'm putting together. I've uh, been working on it these past few days, and I'm just going to deliver that as well because I want you to think about this new year, this new year. By the way, I want to show you, this is the coffee bar that Amanda uh, created that I received as a Christmas present. I'm so excited, <laughs> but I hope you had a glorious Christmas, and I am looking forward to these next few days, six days until the brand new year. I hope that you continue to join me in this call to pray and to fast as we look forward to 2021. Uh, by the way, I think my guys are coming in right now. Here comes Ozzy, the Wonder Dog, and Winston. They've been over to the Fellowship Hall to play. Good morning, gentlemen. But uh, I just want to invite you to join me in this call, a continual call to pray and to fast. Uh, I'm going to put up a song for you as well. It's by a group, I think it's called We the Kingdom. I think it is. And the song is entitled Holy Water. And it talks about in the bridge of that song, right in the middle, it says, I don't want to abuse your grace because it's the only thing that causes me to want to change. God's grace. I love in the Christmas hymn, Silent Night, where it gets to the chorus, where the chorus, it says, with the dawn of redeeming grace. We're, we're now looking at this thing called redeeming grace. We're in that era of God's grace being poured out on us. As we look to 2021, the theme is going to be making disciples. And what does that look like for us to receive, to embrace, and to release God's grace to those around us? I love you all. I'm looking forward to tomorrow to hearing Laura preach, and I'm looking forward to a brand new year. Let's pray. Jesus, thank you for my church family. Bless them today. Guide us today. Help us to use these six days between today and the next Friday, a brand new year, to hear from you, to pray, to fast, and to know where you're leading us. In Jesus' name, amen. By the way, the sanctuary and the fellowship hall are open. The office door is open and the sanctuary door at the top of the ramp is open if you just want to come in and take some time and pray. If you also have some uh, year-end offering, that you want to drop off, you can slip it under the office door, uh, on my office door, and we will get it in the safe. I love you all and have a great Saturday.